they're back i just made a discovery that i'm not too happy about but it was bound to happen it happens every year in every gardener's life and you guys have all seen them they're creepy and ugly with a pointy ugly little tail if you guys are familiar with this i want to know if you know what i'm talking about pause this video and let me know if you know what i'm talking about so i'm gonna sit here and wait while you leave a comment and let me know what i'm talking about yes it is let me i'm talking about these ugly ugly little creatures hanging out eating my tomatoes that i worked so hard look at that has that pointy ugly tail that looks creepy and nobody wants to touch them so they are expected to stay in the camouflage so well oh he's not coming off but I need to get him off because he is eating. What the heck? He is holding on for dear life, guys. Well, I might as well take this little branch off. Oh, I don't like the way this feels, guys. I love to garden, but I don't like the bugs. Ah! Girl, guys. Okay, I'm being dramatic. But I really don't want to squeeze the heck out of this guy. But I'm doing it. Okay, there it is, guys. I know there's many more of these that I'm going to have to take off and find a place for them so the um, birds can find them, which I do have a lot of birds. I'm going to take them over here where it's nice and sunny. Hopefully a bird can fly by and see this delicious little snack. <laughs> and there it is. Go ahead and enjoy them little birds. And obviously when you guys get these guys, you guys probably have to look around because where there's one, there's going to be more. And on top of the fact that something is eating my tomatoes, something is definitely, I mean, some of these uh, worn hornets are probably all over the place. These tomatoes have had a really good run. I'm really proud of them. If you guys are not familiar with these, these are actually tomatoes that I overwinter in the same place. I didn't pull them out. They stayed there over winter and I trim them down in spring. And as you can see, they're overrunning my, my little space here. But they are really making me proud because they've given me tons and tons of tomatoes. Um, however, the ripened ones, I'll show you guys one, are getting eaten alive by something. Look at that. I have to pull that out because there's a lot of little gnats. And there's a lot of tomatoes like that unfortunately so what i'm gonna have to start doing i'm gonna have to start taking them out sooner and letting them ripe in my um in my counter and just enjoy them like this one i could just take it has a little bit of sunburn but it doesn't matter guys i can still enjoy it let's see keep twisting 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 and there's one i could take that piece off We'll put it right there. And then there's another one over here. Hopefully nothing got to this one. Oh, something got to it, guys. I don't know what's eating this. Look at that. That's terrible. These tomatoes are amazing. Now they're wasted. I'm going to give them to my warm compost. And what else, guys? What do I do? What could be eating this? Okay. I'm just going to keep looking. I mean... Oh, there's a bird feather here could be that a bird's coming to eat them and I probably should get you guys mentioned it a little bird um, water what do you call them bird feeders a little fountain or something so they can enjoy the water and not have to get my amazing vegetables that I'm working so hard to get but I'm just gonna keep looking for more to harvest and also more of those horn worms that are really taking over here and eating my amazing fruit hopefully there's not that many more as you can see that one was a baby so most of them I expect them to be the same size I feel that later on when I find some more they're gonna be bigger because they all seem to get um, they all seem to grow around the same same time same same size anyways guys just a quick video keep an eye out for those nasty little worms pull them off let the birds eat them if you have chickens feed them to the chickens and um, just keep an eye out for them. Protect your tomatoes. 
from those critters i'm gonna have to figure out what else is eating these tomatoes because i don't think those hornet worms are eating devouring those tomatoes all in whole if you guys have had that experience where they are leave it in the comments down below because look at this here's another one are you serious and there is some little poop there from those little ugly ugly warm horns so horns so let's see maybe there's more maybe it is them devouring it but i truly truly doubt it i don't think they would eat one whole tomato like that but like i said i don't know last year i didn't have a trouble that much trouble with them so please let me know leave it in the comments down below all right guys you guys have a blessed day i'll see you in the next one meanwhile i'm going to take some of these amazing jalapenos to make another salsa because oh my god guys look at this i have so many things growing in the garden i'm so excited i'm really blessed with everything that's in the garden and i need some more sriracha jalapeno sriracha peppers because those made my salsa taste so good and there's some here but they're not ready so i'm gonna let them sit there a little longer but there is a jalapeno here that's completely ready look at all of those lines usually when you have those lines it means that they're going to be spicy and delicious so look at that yummy super delicious guys what else can i harvest it's like a treasure hunt in here Ooh, i just saw some zucchinis that are ready see that yummy all right well look at that here's another tomato that got eaten completely devoured so i wonder if they are on this tomato as well Jeez. all right my basils are finally kicking in yes so excited about that <gasps> there's more basil yes i'm so excited that they're actually growing and filling up this area because it's about time that we get some more some more do we have some cucumbers i'll harvest that soon all right guys you guys have a blessed day i'll see you in the next one Bye bye